What's up, fams? We got to talk about this. And if you guys are new to the channel, make sure you guys hit that sub button and shout out to my gang, gang, gang. Now, oh, no, say it ain't so. Now, this record industry is crazy. Now, 6 9 must have been dealing with some, some slimy gangster individuals. Now, for the people that don't know what's going on, right, there's this dude that alleges he is Takashi's manager, right? Now, he's also saying that he is El Chapo's nephew. Yes. He's with the Chapos. Now, Takashi was supposed to show up for this concert, right? And by the way, this was like right before Takashi went to jail. He was supposed to show up and he didn't show up. Now, because he didn't show up, the guy is like losing money. He got big mad, right? He told Takashi he was going to call up some government officials to get him put in jail. And he also told 6 9 that he was going to call up Big Gucci Trump. Actually, he didn't say Trump, but he was going to get Takashi's mother deported back to Mexico. Now, you guys watch this video. This is crazy because this dude is threatening 6 9 Listen to this, man. What's up, Sam? This is me, Jose. So I guess you didn't have the courtesy to respond to me back, no? You need to please tell Danny, bro, that he needs to fucking call me and he needs to come to my show, okay? I ain't his fucking saying his fucking brothers he ain't gonna fucking play with me he needs to come to his show or i'm gonna call his probation okay i'm gonna call his fucking probation i know a lot of government people and i'm gonna send his fucking ass to jail if he don't come to austin texas today he fucking makes me lose money already where's my fucking tickets he needs to fucking come and be a fucking man i'll put his fucking ass in jail he don't fucking know me okay his brother lives there his mama lives there she don't even have no fucking papers so he needs to fucking, he ain't fucking with no fucking stupid idiots. You fucking tell him, brother. Now, the weird thing about the situation is that, you know, I go to this guy's page and he got all kinds of videos hugged up with 6 9s mom. Now, I don't know if these are old videos or what, but seeing how he was threatening him and his mother, this sounds crazy. Now, you guys remember the video where Takashi goes, look, man, I don't got no manager. I don't got no booking agency, right? The dude fired everybody, right? That video was reportedly recorded right after Takashi got off the phone with this guy, right? And that's where everything went left. Now, the situation gets even weirder because if you look at the caption of the video, like Takashi is still telling the guy like, look, I'm not showing up to the August show, but we're still going to do business now. I don't know if Takashi was saying that because he was scared, right? Because he believed that this guy is really El Chapo's nephew, and I'm not doubting that at all. Now, El Chapo's lawyers, they have came out and said they are not aware of this person being El Chapo's nephew. So, listen, this situation is very weird. Uh, it's being reported right now that El Chapo's nephew threatened 6 9 He threatened to have his mother deported back to Mexico if he didn't show up to a concert. Now, this gives you guys a view of some of the stuff that appears to be happening in music right now, right? You got people that are threatening you because you won't show up for a show because they're losing money, man. This is crazy. What do you guys think about this in the comment section below, man? Hide your kids, hide your wives, they deporting people. It's getting crazy out here, man. And anyway, shout out to everyone that watched my videos. I love you guys.